Hey all brothers and sisters, my name is Captain Meatshield and welcome back to the Settlers 2, where the war has been going well. The war for Island 6? Here's maps, like Island slash map number 6, isn't it? Yeah, that's where we're at. Uh, so yes, last episode, there was an enemy headquarters here, and now it is gone. Which I think is rather good. <laughs> We do have, uh, we've managed to clear out a lot of our own military structures. We've got quite a few uh, generals in reserve at the moment. We've got some of almost every rank, which is pretty good. We do have quite a few privates in some of these uh, structures near the front line. Uh, so I'm just kind of letting some gold coins come down to promote those guys up. But what I want to do today is try to wipe these guys out as much as possible. We'll see where things are going down on... In fact, yeah, let's let's start sticking our nose in around this way. We'll, we'll get some lookout towers down, see what we're dealing with. Let's stick one over this way as well. I want to get, get... Let my soldiers have a chance to... Uh, kind of reacclimatize themselves now that um, all of the the mess from last episode the, the last episode is over and done with but soon enough we will be pushing our advantage again we'll try and get rid of this uh, pinky purple faction and we're gonna have to turn our attention to these golden buggers mmm I'm watching you Probably not close enough, closely enough, but I am watching. Yeah, watch it. I do think these guys are pretty much dead in the water now. Obviously, if they've got, you know, the resources to go and build, um, like iron smelting works, smithies, breweries, and have storehouses around to be able to, um, like train up new soldiers, they, and they they would have an opportunity to be able to try and take back some of this territory. But I don't know what state they'd be in if they haven't got a headquarters. I don't know if there's going to be any coordination because nothing seems to be happening around half of these roads. This is very interesting. You're done with coins, good. You're done with coins, good. I think most of these are done with coins, good. It's just this one, at the moment. How is the coin supply, actually? Let's see how we're doing on those. We've got three in reserve. 70 something... Gold... Yeah, we're doing okay on our supplies. It's not too bad. Okay, I'm trying to build stuff up down here. It's only a well, but... These guys are trying to do stuff, which is interesting enough. A lookout tower has been built. I'm thinking once I get an idea of where I can put my choke points around this area. Thank you, autosave. Um, I might make this into like a new production hub. Try and uh, replicate some of the stuff that we've got going on over here and bring it down towards the front lines. Because I think that would be quite handy for obviously pushing a, pushing advantage forward and expanding our territory, not having to worry about supplies having to travel quite so far. Because while I could bring roads across these mountains, I haven't yet. Um, this harbour's not actually stockpiling anything, which you know, I'm not too fussed about. But uh, look out, town manned. Right, what do we got? Oh, right, okay, this goes around even further than I expected. Hmm. Okay. Intriguing. Okay, well, you're all done then, thank you very much. Uh, what coal mine ran out? You did. Alrighty. Let's get a geologist out here in a minute. And see how much more coal there is. Right. Aha. So this little block of these guys 
is all that is holding the gold faction back. Hmm. This is where things will get interesting. And they're push they're building a barracks there, so they're trying to push potentially around this way. Ooh. That is interesting. Hmm. Ooh. <sighs> Alright, we're all done with our coins. For now, promotions are all done. So I'm gonna clear out some more of these guys. Let me just take a handful more of their buildings. Uh, yeah, we'll go for that one as well. Why not? Well, that one went down quickly. Bloody hell. Oh, there goes that one. And the other one's gone as well. So I want to see what the connection like might be like towards... Whatever this landmass is over here, what these guys have got going on. I'm curious to see what's going to happen with that. Okay, what's going to be the best way of getting around this? Straight down the middle and then out to the left, or all the way around this way? I think we'll just go around this way. Ooh. I might actually be able to get a foothold over here. Can I build a waterway over? Uh huh. If I could get over here and build a woodcutter site, I could clear this space out and potentially get a barracks over here. I'm not sure how viable that might be, but it's certainly a possibility. I could also upgrade this to a guardhouse and expand the uh, the border a little bit. So that's another option. Hmm. Another iron mine's fucking run out. Alright. How are we doing on iron? 133? Yeah, we're fine. Fucking Christ, we're up to our eyeballs in beer as well. Maybe... I don't know, do I want to shut down the brewery? Hmm. I don't think so. We've got a surplus of almost everything at the moment, so... Why would I? Okay. I've cleared out a bit more space. <laughs> I've taken a bit more space. <laughs> oh, wow. Yep. We're breaking into our reserves of privates, at the very least. Just while we're pushing these front lines forward a little bit more and seeing where we can get to. I want to get another lookout tower down here. Just get a better look over this way. I want to see how far down these guys have gone. Oh wow, they've already upgraded that into a watchtower? These are some busy little bees. Ooh. I don't know if I like that. No sir. There's one thing I'm thinking of doing. When it comes down to actually pushing this front forward into towards the uh, the gold faction, the yellow faction. This might take these two watchtowers and I'll hold here so I can get lookout towers up to keep an eye out for like um, catapults and all that kind of stuff. And it's going to be a case of, I think, a very slow advance. Uh, I'm going to upgrade this. I'm going to extend this to see if I can push these borders out any further. See if I can try and get across here. But the fisherman's hut's run out. Bloody hell. Really running out on those. Well, that being said, I could probably bring one down here now. This, this is doable. I should also check all of these mountains to find out what resources may or may not be in them. I'm also going to set up these two stone mines. The stone supplies are getting a little low and I've not found any that I can get out of the ground, so I'm going to have to start pulling it out of the mountains. <sighs> Should be manageable. Right. Okay, they haven't broken down here. 
just yet. So I can push forward and leave a couple of these military buildings to kind of keep these guys hemmed in a little bit. Just waiting for this storehouse to get built before I start pushing the front much further. A lot of gold coins coming down at the moment. But it's good, it means we're going to get some uh, nicely promoted soldiers. This woodcutter has cleared out all the trees around here for me, which is very generous of him. Thank you very much. Stone mine built. Storehouse finished. Cool. Right, I'm going to tear down this guy. And these guys look like they've run out of resources. This upgrade is not going anywhere, is it? No. Alright, I'll have that. I'll have that. And I'll wait to have that. Ooh, gold mines run out. Ain't that a shocker? Let's get my geologist back out, find out where the next good patch is going to be. Either way, the advance down this way is going rather well. Oh shit, are we under attack? No. No, we're not. Don't know what was going on there. The fuck even is these roads? The fuck even was that sentence? Seriously, they're a bloody disgrace. Do you people not understand the meaning of efficiency? Alright, that has expanded my borders over this way a little bit. Okay, let's see if I can make this work. If I come down here, erect a flag, we'll go erect a flag there. Can I build a woodcutter's hut? Because I don't know whether or not I can get people across this. I know I can tr get resources over there by... Um, carriers that will sit on rafts. But it's also a matter of whether I've got any building. I have got rafts. I've got some. Okay. Because there's some stone here. I could do with some stone. Oh, you match up with my roads. You beautiful building, you. <laughs> I don't know why I get so uptight about these. <laughs> Another coal mine's run out. Fan Dabby Dozy. Thank you very much. Oh. Oh, we've. D oh, fuck. Holy shit, that's a lot of generals. Oh, my word. It just came out of nowhere. God damn. My guys are getting slaughtered. Well, somewhat. Some of them are winning. I'm losing a lot, though. Jesus Christ, that came out of nowhere. So many of those guys are walking away with such little health. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> God damn. Oh, man. That was some scary shit. These guys are going to be tough. These guys are going to be very tough. Let's get another look out tower, see what they've got going on. Ah, oh, right, they have kind of snuck down this side a little bit. See, so, yeah, we've not got much dividing us. We've got this little strip here, which is, and then this little strip here. It's a real kind of no man's land at the moment. Yeah, considering these guys are barely exist anymore. Under attack at a watchtower. Holy fuck! They are going for it! 
I mean, jeez, they're really going for it. And by the looks of it, they're getting it. Yep. Okay, um, let's go for things up this way. Let's try and push around while they're busy. Jesus. They are going to clear me out of soldiers. Fucking pronto. Uh, shit. Okay, well, they, they're... Mm, that was unexpected. <laughs> oh, Christ, I hurt. I mean, yeah, okay, I've got some generals in reserve, but... <sighs> this is going to be a hard put. They're coming back in again. They have had so much time to prepare for this. That is insane. And now they're attacking me where I'm weakest. Look at this. Privates coming out to fight generals. I've got one general out... Oh, I've got two. Three. Three. Out on this field. There's another one. I'm not expecting the best of this situation. Hmm. <laughs> I'm going to try and push around this way while they're busy. If I can try and box them in and get, like, a nice choke point where I can, like, kind of hold them at bay, maybe. I'm not expecting this to go well at all. And we're going well up here because there's nothing to defend against, or there's nothing for them to defend with. I've only just barely held on to this. Where the fuck are you going? Really? You want to go and fight there? <laughs> you walked all that way just to die. <sighs> That's a shame. Fuck. This is where it all goes tits up. Alright, let's just take these last two over this way. Where are you going? Oh, you're going in there. I see. Okay. Well, we've cleared these guys out. Rest in peace, fellas. It was fun. Oh, wow. Look at that. <laughs> Why, where, why won't you go away? Fisherman's hut's out. Uh, I've got... How little gold is left up here? I kind of need that. I also need you guys to stop tripping me the fuck out, because this is really weird now. It's the weird sound of them all dying. <laughs> oh, that was odd. Right, we do still have some gold up here. So that's something. Who are you? Who are you? What do you want? Excuse me, sir. Can I help you? Where are you going? You seem lost. Don't know if he's here to fight or if he's just wandering until he dies. Maybe it's a bit of both. Under attack. Leave me alone! I can't handle your superb, superior soldiers! Right, this woodcutter's hut is not being a thing. I can't get people across these road, uh, waterways, so... You may... Oh, you're gonna just... Stay there until you're dead. Oh no, you're swimming back, swimming back, are you? Alright. Now the coal mines run out. Okay. I need more coal. 
Find me more coal. Uh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Yes. Plug that in. Come on, guys, hold out, please. Yes, we're doing a bit better. Uh, you're not. Fucking hell, there's just so many of them. There's one general left in this. Uh, he's stuck in there on his own because I can't get roads round to him. Mm. Oh, where, why, and what? Under it. Oh. Again, you went all the way over there just to die. Where are you going? Are you going all the way over there just to die? I don't understand you people. Really don't. Not, not the slightest bloody clue. Right. Am I getting any soldiers to reinforce some of these buildings? Because... This should be fully manned, and it isn't. I would like to know why. Also considering upgrading that into a... Uh, stronghold. That could be a thing. Right. Any military reinforcements? Do I have any in reserve? No, I don't. I'm completely boned. Ugh. You guys... You guys are going to test my patience. That... Of that I am assured. <laughs> what we got up over this way? I'm already seeing catapults. Watchtowers everywhere. Oh, and you're off on the charge again. Are oh, you coming up over this way this time? That's nice. I don't know how I feel about that. Stone mine's already run out. Alright. Uh, I need to sort out gold mine. Come on, guys. Hold the line. Really need that line held. Extension not possible due to lack of space. In what way is there a lack of space? Okay, that just can't be expanded upon, apparently, and I don't know why. How many of my soldiers have died? I'm uh, figuring a fair few. If that guy's been coming in and out of the watchtower, then, yep, there's going to be a few. Oh, fucking hell. I do not know how I'm going to do this. Where did you go? I thought you were dead. I don't know what to do here. I am... <laughs> All of my soldiers are dead. All of them are gone. How do I do this? Oh, God, where are we under attack now? Back down here? Okay, well, that's not all generals this time. There's still a lot of soldiers, but it's not all generals. Okay, maybe... We, we've held back the, the brunt of the, uh, the charge. Well, if this guy dies, this tower's gone. Maybe... We're in a slightly better steading now that we've held out that first, held up against that first attack. Ooh, honestly, I don't know. All I know is I fucking need soldiers. I need to find more coal. That is a major priority right now. I've got the food to be able to supply the mines. I just need to be able to get the mines down. Um. Shit, I'm really running low on gold as well. No, don't worry about that. No resources at Fisherman's Hut? Yeah, okay, fine, go away. Um, right, how much gold is left up here? I'll start worrying about the supplies in this part of the mountain as well. Coal found down here? Good. Get a mine there. Under attack at a watchtower again. But again, I'm not seeing generals in their forces. Their troops are starting to weaken. Oh. 
I'm feeling a little more confident about this now. Not by much. Ever so slightly. Oh, you're trying to upgrade that into a stronghold as well. Despite the fact that you can't even get roads through to the damn thing. What's wrong with you? The other stone mines run out. No problem. Let's get rid of these roads. If I can hold out long enough to reinforce buildings down here, I'll start trying to take this territory back again. Things are looking up. Things are looking a little bit better. I've just got to hold out long enough for um, a new supply of soldiers to come along. There is still some gold in the in these hills as well, which is good. And it starts from around here, so we'll put a mine there just to mark that off. Ooh, actually goes down about as far as this. In fact, so we'll go from there. Just plug that up as well. Why not? Yeah, I know I'm under attack. That doesn't surprise me anymore. A completely redundant statement. I know I'm under attack. When am I not gonna be? I'm rather alarmed by the fact that only the soldiers in this watchtower are the ones defending here. They've got a lot of troops to get through. Yeah, I know I'm under attack. Am I under attack at another watchtower? No, it's still this one. Oh, I do have another general coming up to help. Well, that's nice. Taking his bloody time about it, but... You know, he's here, that's what matters. Oh, this is getting kind of terrifying. Shit, I lost one. I mean, it would help if I knew what the, uh... The difference between their ranks, you know, the difference, the the visual differences between the ranks of the Mongol faction, it helped me assess battle situations a hell of a lot easier. Shit, there goes another one. And you've got two hits left in you. Please don't die. You're the last bastion against these fuckers. Come on. Oh no. Yes. This is getting ridiculous. The amount of skulls that are lying around everywhere is just insane. <sighs> okay, I think... While things feel... A little... I was gonna say things have calmed down a little bit, but no, I can already see troops on the move. Whether he's just going to reinforce a structure or if he's actually on his way over to attack, I don't know, but... This is going to be one hell of a slog. Because there is so much land between us and the portal. I honestly don't know how we're going to get through all of this. Yeah, they've got a, a healthy gold coin supply coming down to train up their soldiers as well. I mean, with any luck, some of it might be stored in this storehouse. I might be able to try and barge over and destroy that. That might help the situation. But otherwise, I really don't know how we're going to push forward from here. It is going to be a very long time and a lot of effort that's going to go into this. This is going to be a fun one, guys. But okay, I'm going to pause before anything else happens. I'm just going to wrap this video up here and just say thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, check out the playlists on the channel for more Let's Plays on Metal Covers, and give this video a like or a comment just to leave your thoughts. And if you wish to join the ever-growing ranks of the Order of the Shield, subscribe on YouTube, chuck me a follow over on Twitch, or maybe even consider checking out my Patreon and becoming an officer within the ranks. But thank you again for watching this video, and I will catch you all very, very soon. This is Captain Meat Shield, signing off. Don't worry, I just gotta pick the lock before I can come and smash your face in.
He's not even in this room. 